Today I did the White River Marathon 5K. Made it to the uh, 5K, doing a little bit of warm up. There's a lot of people here already, so uh, pretty excited. Nice, cool weather. Uh, that's about 45, 47 degrees or so. So pretty good uh, morning so far. So definitely <laughs> I'm getting trying to get warm up, get my legs going. Thank you, Nick, for the national anthem. So that was the uh, marathon and half marathon start, and the 5K starts three minutes later, so I kind of warmed up a little too early, so I'm gonna. Uh, re warm up a little bit. Should be good. We'll see what, what how we do. Hopefully, I get a personal best today. Like, uh, my personal best is like 2014, 2015 or so. So, hopefully, we're looking for that under 20 minutes. It is flat. It's a downhill start. guys just got home um, the, the white river marathon did the 5k version of it, it was it was a great race it's pretty competitive i think there's somebody that was like uh, um, over 50 and did it in 18 minutes it was a female she was actually the overall winner she, she did really great i got fifth fifth overall did it in 20 minutes and 16 seconds which was like uh, six and a half minute miles the first mile i did it like under six and six and uh Mile, minute miles um, under six minutes and I think it was like 540 that's my fastest mile since uh, and it was a great uh, downhill start and through this little trail so I didn't get a lot of finish during the race just because I was huffing puffing trying to <laughs> trying to do as best as I can to uh, again this this race was dedicated to my wife Brandy 
because she, she was supposed to run this race with, with me, uh, the 5K, and then we were supposed to do the Little Rock Marathon uh, the following day. But uh, this was this was all for Brandy here, and um, even though I didn't get first place overall, I definitely wanted that. I did get. I gotta show you guys what. The finisher's medal, and this is the first place medal there. And so it shows you 4344 first place. All right, guys, <clears throat> it was a great race. Uh, they kind of did a, a different route than they had <clears throat> done before, and the finish line was underneath this bridge right next to the river and I definitely enjoyed it the, the wind was a little cool for my lungs so definitely my, if you ever had that burning in your lungs uh, after a run that's what I kind of felt like today um, I did really good on for first mile it was about 549 uh, minute pace uh, the leaders I could not keep up with them that was and again I was fifth um, overall and I got first in my age group. That river marathon race, definitely if you're looking for a downhill race, a smaller race, um, they, I think they allow about 700 people. And it's a good race, it's a good cause too. So they raise money for a, a tribe in Kenya. <clears throat> and, uh, and so the person that organizes it, he talked about um, what they did last year. They were able to raise enough money for uh, water, clean water for about 400 and something children, which is great. And then you can also donate your old shoes, recycle your old shoes to the uh, organization as well. So that way they take those shoes to the uh, the tribe and I think they either ground it up for uh, playground material. If their shoes are wearable, they, they'll donate the shoes to the individuals as well. Uh, definitely a great cause, <clears throat> great race. Uh, the weather is usually fair, fairly, you know, good. You know, it's usually like in the 40s or so. I think one year it, it was like in 25 degrees uh, Fahrenheit. And one, and one year it actually started off at 70 degrees. It was really warm. So it can vary <clears throat> with this time of year what weather it is. And again, it's a straight, flat a marathon. It is a Boston Marathon qualifier. So if you do run the marathon uh, you, you, and you qualify, <clears throat> this one will qualify you for the Boston Marathon as well. <clears throat> That's a good race. Uh, Brandy, my wife, was supposed to run it uh, this week, so this race was dedicated to her and uh, my efforts. I was trying to <laughs> trying to get first place for her, but I, you know, even though I didn't get first place overall, I did get first place in my age group. Uh, <clears throat> that was definitely a win for her, and uh, uh, was anticipating maybe running it with her uh, this time, and just because we were going to do the. Uh, Little Rock Marathon, I was going to save my energy, but I decided to just go ahead and go <clears throat> all out, try to get a PR. Didn't get a PR, I was two seconds off of tying my PR, which is two hours and 14 minutes, which I did this summer. Um, second mile was uh, <clears throat> not as not as good as the first mile because it was a downhill start, so I had a lot, a lot of speed going down. And so uh, <clears> the <throat> third mile was a little better, uh, but overall it was definitely a good race. I was pleased with my... Uh, my time and my efforts there. <clears throat> so this concludes this video. Hope everyone keeps safe out there. Keep running and we'll see you next time. Bye.